welcome back to this week's plan with me so really quickly this is what last week ended up looking like I know the glare makes it a little difficult to see but yeah I'm really happy with it again I loved the colors this week um, but this week I think I'm going to do a bumblebee theme just because I have um, BB washi that I got from Scotch Expressions that I really want to use. I just think this is so cute and of course any excuse to use the grass washi. So I think I want to do um, a bee theme this week and I have some other like washi tapes that I think I might end up using as well. It's pretty much just going to be yellow and black with a little bit of green um, especially because the headers are green. I don't want to have to cover those up. I have also picked out um, a few stickers that I want to use. These ones were um, from the dollar sticker books, like the Doris dollar sticker books. My friend Sandy actually gave me a few sheets of hers. Um, and that's a great tip because though, I mean, the books are only a dollar, I know, but they give you so many sheets and a lot of the sheets are pretty much the same stickers, just repeated. Um, so it's great if you buy like a bunch of those books and share it with friends and whatnot. So she can, um, ended up giving me a couple of sheets from her sticker book. So I'm definitely going to use those. And then I also, um, printed out and cut some stickers that I think I want to use as well. I really love this pattern. Um, and then I have a couple of these like black and white um, stripes with a little heart that says love on it. Um, some yellow flowers, a little bit of green, and then these little um, yellow and gray flowers I think I might bring in as well. Um, so I'm not going to be using a ton of Etsy stickers this week. Um, probably just little like icons for different tasks that I have to do, but that is pretty much it. Okay, so I'm going to take this black and white like... Um, single chevron washi tape. This is from Michaels and I think I'm going to put this along the bottom. I want to put this along the side here and then maybe take this black and white striped one like right next to it or maybe flip flop it. I'm not 100% sure yet how I want to do this. love to know what you guys are doing this week. I always like knowing like what other people's themes are for the week and how you guys decide on a theme. It's for me it's like I look through my stickers and my washi. I try to figure out first like what I want to use and then I try to like create a theme around that if possible or if I have any like stickers that match or whatnot. Um, so this week I really wanted to use like I said the bee washi tape as well as this grass washi tape So I decided I was gonna do bumblebee theme. Um, so I'm gonna put this grass washi along the bottom So it's kind of like, you know representative of grass already really liking the way this is turning out and then I'll take the bee washi and I'll put it along the top here um, I'll probably bring this one in um, a bit more but for now I'm just going to put it along the top Um, and then I do have these um, stickers that I cut out that are going to fill up a good amount of space. So I think I want to put those down. Um, let's see how I want to do this. I'm 
probably put these along the bottom. I'm not 100% sure, but the rest of these I think look pretty good. So I'm going to go ahead and stick those down. All right, I really like that. Okay, so now I think I'm gonna bring in a little bit more of the bumblebee washi, but first I think I wanna put in my um, to-do like checklists. And these are from Simply Watercolor Co. If you guys haven't seen my last Etsy sticker haul, I will link that down below. I hauled these in that video. This was from her like, um, oops, grab bag. Um, and these I think will go well because it's green and yellow, so I'll just use a mixture of the two. Um, and I'll try to just plug them in wherever um, they fit. And this is definitely different than I normally do. Uh, my like spreads, normally I'll put all my checklists like in one location and then all my YouTube stuff and all that stuff. But because I have these full boxes kind of scattered about, I'm just gonna kind of see where these checklists fit and then put them, you know, wherever. I'm not gonna be too picky about it. And I do have some washi strips that I've already like pre-cut to fit in here. And I think I'm gonna put this B one here just to fill up the space a little bit beneath the checklist. There we go. Yeah, I like that. And I think I'm gonna put more of the bee washi here in this top section of the weekend just to, actually, you know what? I'm gonna put the grass. I think I wanna bring more grass in there. gonna put some washi along this side I don't have anything like skinny that would go with this that would fit here but I think I'm gonna put this one down anyway and just fold it over onto the next page because I do have some space over here that I don't mind like covering up with washi and I think it'll go nicely with this anyway so I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that just because this side is filled all the way and this one kind of has just like a blank strip and I am not loving it so I, I'm gonna go ahead and do that That doesn't look bad at all. I actually really like how that looks on the other side. And then now this side is covered as well. I know it's not like a huge difference, but I do really like it. I feel like it brings it together a little bit more. And I'm gonna take another one of these pre-cut strips that I did and put it here. I'm just gonna fill in like areas that I think I want to add more of that B washi tape to just to really emphasize the B theme for this week. Um, so I like it there. And now I think I'm gonna bring in these um, stickers from the dollar sticker books. And it's nice because I actually have a couple of like bigger stickers that I could use like for this top corner right here. I have this beehive which I think is adorable. This one that says be happy and this one that says busy as a bee. Honestly this week isn't that busy but I think I still want to use this just because I feel like it'll stand out the best in this corner. I like this one a lot, but because it is yellow and this is yellow, I don't think it'll stand out as much. Um, so I think I'm gonna use this and then maybe add like a few flowers as well. This is so cute. I love that. Okay, um, and then I guess I'll just decorate with the rest of these little bees. This one says Queen Bee on it. Oh, you know what? It's actually my aunt's birthday on the 29th, and maybe I'll stick one of these on there to kind of signify her birthday. Or maybe this one. This one's really cute too with the little flower. I also have these stickers from Sweet Ava's Paper, so I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to put one of the bees down here, and I think I like the one holding the flowers because I think I'm going to, let's see, yeah, that's really cute. Because I think I'm going to put like a cupcake in the bee's hand or something. I think that would be really cute, actually. Um, oh my gosh, I just ripped off her antenna. I just realized it's still stuck on here.
Oh well, I feel like I need tweezers for that. But yeah, I think I'm gonna put a cupcake in her hand. Let's do this one. I don't actually, I'm not sure if this is going to work out, but I think that would be a lot of fun. Yeah, I think that actually is really cute. And maybe put a little birthday hat on her. I think that would be so much fun. Let's see, I didn't even think this through, but I kind of like it. That is adorable. I kind of really love that. Um, that turned out a lot better than I thought it would, so that's perfect. Okay. And I actually don't have a weekend banner that goes with this theme. Um, and if you guys have watched my last couple plan with me's, you know I normally just like make one if I don't have one. Um, but this week, I don't think I'm going to do that. I did block it out already, so I feel like it's, it already stands out on its own. And maybe I'll just decorate it a little bit more. Um, I think that will be fun. And so, let's see, which ones do I want to use? I really love these bees down here maybe I'll put these down because eh, I don't know I'm not sure what Blake and I are doing this weekend but we can pretend this is my bee and we can pretend that this is Blake's bee we're just hanging out yeah I think these are really cute they're kind of hard to see but yeah that's adorable Then I think I'll just use the rest of these stickers and just kind of spread them around. So I think that that is it as far as decorating goes. It's already looking a lot busier than I had anticipated. I just couldn't help myself with the stickers. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and fill out some of the things that I know for sure are happening this week. Like I know I have a cell phone bill due on the 26th. So I think I'm just going to use these teardrops to mark that. <laughs> And tomorrow I do want to remember to mail out a birthday card so it'll get there by Saturday. And I think I'm going to use this little mail sticker and this is from, I believe it's Stickerific. <music> And then I think I'll go ahead and fill in my to-dos for today. Um, I do want to clean my makeup brushes and now I get to use my clean makeup brush stickers from Ashy Lee Design. So I'm going to take one of those. want to do the dishes and put them away and I have these dishwasher stickers also from Ashley Lee Designs. And I do have to call the pet sitter today because we're going on vacation um, next month and so I need to call him and just make sure that he is available to watch the boys while we're gone. So I'm going to take these cute cat stickers that look kind of like Baron PJ. These are both from Sweet Ava's paper. I just cut them, I just cut the sheet in half. Um, and I'm just gonna stick those here and just write that I have to call the pet sitter. <laughs> And I do want to put in YouTube video, stuff like that. Um, and I think because this is already pretty cluttered, I'm just going to use my little like YouTube icons. These will be perfect because they're really tiny. These are from Pop Fizz Paper. And I think I'll just put them in the days that I plan to do YouTube related things. And I'm going to put in the syringe stickers for Blake's allergy shots. Again, these are from Libby Co. 
and I have my meal planning stickers also from Libby & Co that I will just put in as well and I'll use like the more yellowy gold ones. And I think that's all I'm going to fill in for now, but I do have a lot of space on this side and I have some of these larger like flags that were in the um, Simply Watercolor Co set and let's see if this will fit. Let me take the green one and I might put this here. I can use this as kind of like a to buy section, kind of like what I did last week. So I guess I can just go ahead and write that. And then I'll take this other flag and put it below it. And this will be just anything I need to do for next week. I love this pen. It writes really nicely on glossy stickers as well as on matte paper. Um, but yeah, I think that this is it. So I've gone ahead and put it back into the planner and I think it looks really cute. I really like the way that it turned out. It's definitely really different from what I've been doing before. I feel like this is more busy and it's not as like streamlined um, compared to like the past weeks that I've done. I feel like with these weeks, everything had its place. Like I feel like all my to-dos were at the top, all my YouTube stuff was like in the middle and then all of like my evening and meal planning stuff was at the bottom. Same with this week. I feel like it was just I don't know a lot a lot more streamlined whereas this one is definitely more busy and kind of like all over the place which I think it's nice to kind of you know change things up a little bit let me know what you guys prefer um we'll see how I feel about this um when I'm done with the week I guess and I'll show you guys what it looks like next week um but yeah if you guys enjoy these plan with me videos I'd really appreciate it if you gave this video a thumbs up um so I know to keep doing them obviously <laughs> um, I'm not going to do it if you guys don't want to see it um and also let me know if for next week's plan with me if you guys want to see how I plan on decorating my like monthly view as well as the first week of September. Um, let me know also if you guys have any requests or suggestions for any themes. I actually really like how this black and white stripe washi turned out on the side. But yeah, that is my B theme for this week. Um, thank you so much for watching all of the shops mentioned in this video, which I didn't use that many um, Etsy stickers this week, actually. I just used um, Simply Watercolor Co., a few Libby & Co. stickers, and a few little like icons from several different shops. But yeah, I will list those down below as well as any coupon codes I may have. I'll also link my last Etsy sticker haul if you guys haven't seen it. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great upcoming week. I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye!